Hi, my name is Tom. Today we're going to show you how to defeat uh, the coin mechanism on an old Monarch pool table. This pool table is in the house right this minute and they no longer want to have the quarter required, so we're going to defeat the coin slot. Uh, how long did it take and how much did it cost? Well, it didn't really cost me anything. It took me two little wire ties and a small washer and uh, it took me about an hour. So let's get started. So this entire mechanism comes out of the table by just putting the lock in and they had the key. So as soon as you uh, remove the, the lock, the whole thing will come out. All of the balls normally show up in this window here. You'd normally put just a quarter in this slot right here, push it in and it would actually release the balls. So the fun thing about this one is it actually has a counter. So this particular machine has had 41,324 different games played on it over its lifetime, which is kind of fun. So now we're gonna look at the mechanism. So I've already defeated the mechanism because it's easier for me to show you what's going on with the ball release. So what normally happens is that as you push this in, this roller right here pushes this entire assembly forward and the balls are dropped down into the slot. Then they're released into here and they flow into the front side of the pool table. So you can, again, we're gonna take one more look Push it in, this drops the balls, and that second portion releases them into the, into the pool table front. So in order to make this alteration, you have to get this coin slot mechanism out. So there's just a few things that you have to do. There's this coin cover here, there's two fasteners here, there's this upper section of it, there's two fasteners, one here and one here, and then there's two fasteners, actually little bolts that are here and here, that actually hold the um, coin slot mechanism to the release mechanism. So we're gonna take all that apart, and then we're gonna have just this, at which point I'll show you how to defeat the mechanism. Now that we have the coin slot mechanism out, let's take a look at it. This is for a quarter slot machine, and there's the quarter. There are two things that are detecting the coin. The first is this piece right here. It's detecting the top of the coin. It's gonna stay up as long as there's a coin in there, but when there's not a coin in there, it's gonna fall, and then it's gonna jam against this part of the um, operation. The other part that's harder to see is this piece right here. It's going to actually detect the side of the coin. So I'm gonna show you how the top piece works because it's a little easier to show. So I'm gonna drop the coin in there. You can see how when I push it across, this piece does not fall in, but the coin falls out. Now watch again when I'm actually without the coin. You can see how it drops in and then it gets caught. So we're gonna defeat both of those and I'm gonna show you how to do that in just a second. So the first part I'm going to, to defeat is the side of the coin detector. So you can see the spring is here. There's a hole right here, and I'm going to stick it through the hole uh, once I push the side detector piece through. So I'm going to turn it over. There's the side detector right there. I'm going to push it across, slide my wire tie into the hole, and then cinch it up. So the second portion of the mechanism I'm going to defeat is the top of the coin detection. So what I've done is I've just taken a washer and I've sanded down the corners of that washer and I'm going to put that washer right in here and then I'm going to put a wire tie over it so it holds that coin right in there. So there it is. The dimension here actually is the same dimension as between. I'm going to slide it in there. I'm going to take my wire tie. Get it tight in there, trim it off. And now, when I put the coin in with both defeated, so once again, this is the wire tie that's defeating the side coin detection. And this is the wire tie with that little washer that had its edges uh, uh, filed off that's defeating the top coin detection. So now we're putting it back in. You can see there's one, two, three, four. There's these little screws. These are very simple to put in. Uh, 
and then I will reassemble all of the coin drop parts uh, and we'll be done. So now that we've put the rest of the coin capture mechanism back, we can see that now this will push all the way forward and release the ball. Thanks for watching and I certainly hope this helps.